the time I was videoing and then all of a sudden I realised that was my name up there. I had to give my phone to somebody else who was sitting on a table and then that was all a blur. The rest was just, a, just emotion. It was just an elation. It's such an important accolade because I'm not a men's hairdresser. I am a male grooming specialist. That's what I do day in, day out. So it validates what I do. I believe it's one of the hardest competitions for me to enter because it wasn't based upon photographs. It was based upon me internalizing each question and thinking, how do I answer this to the best of my ability? Not to sound big headed, but to get across what I need to say in a very small word count and not oversay it and not overdo it. And um, it really engaged my mind in a way that no other competition has done. Really look at your story and your story and communicate that story the best way you can. Be genuine with your story. Um, tell your dreams, aspirations that you have. And I, that's what I did in my entry. I let people know where I've come from and where I am now. Um, tell your story. Mm -hmm.